After 9-11, 2001, I joined the Army, did uh, infantry stuff for a while, deployed a couple times, and then went on to do uh, Special Forces, ended up in a small mission unit at Fort Bragg. I am the owner and founder of Rest Float Solutions here in downtown Colorado Springs. Also a 16-year medically retired Army vet and a co-founder of a nonprofit called uh, Coast to Coast Foundation. Uh, 2012, October, about six years ago, pretty close to the day, I was fatally wounded in northern Iraq on a mission. We were hitting a uh, compound and just ran into a hornet's nest. And two out of the three guys that were in the main contact um, made it out. We did lose one guy that night, Ryan Sabard, who is part of the Coast to Coast Foundation and the reason why we started Coast to Coast. Uh, after that, you know, Going through physical therapy and surgeries, you know, I had about 30, 40 surgeries by the end of it, by the end of the year, and just kind of working through issues. And really the only thing that was helping me was getting back to yoga, meditating, working out, eating healthy. Uh, so I was looking for alternative means and just so happened we were doing some training up at Virginia Beach with some Navy SEALs. And one of my bosses told me about these float tank things. And he really didn't know much about it. He actually told me that it's something that, you know, it's really good for your body and it's weightless. There's a lot of salt, it's super buoyant. I'm like, oh, what the heck is this? Not, no clue, 2014, no clue what floating was. Did it, it had a huge uh, profound effect on me. It strug struggled with a lot of pain issues, a lot of nerve pain, uh, trouble sleeping, just, you know, the, the stuff when you're hurting, it's tough to do. And, you know, with a traumatic brain injury and along with uh, some other things, this, the float therapy was something that really clicked with me and my mind and my body. And I continued to do it, um, going to NICO and, you know, six months later, I did 20 floats in 24 days where I saw a huge drastic difference in my body chemistry, my mentality, my personality, the way, you know, the sleep I was getting and just kind of overall health and wellness. So, you know, around 2015, decided to open up uh, float shops here in uh, Colorado Springs and just went from there. I was still in the Army at the time, stayed in the Army another year. Uh, this, we opened in September of 2015, so we've been open a little over three years now. And one of the biggest reasons I did it was to help brothers and sisters who have traumatic brain injuries. You know, the walking wounded where you don't, they don't look hurt, but you know, they're hurting on the inside, mentally, uh, physically, emotionally, just that distress and you know, the float tank was what helped me kind of get back to myself, helped me reconnect with my mind and body. And then I've been doing that ever since. And it's, you know, it doesn't matter if you're military or you're civilian or if you're in a car accident or had concussions playing a sport. We, we help and work with everybody from police to firefighters, to, you know, Green Berets on base there to the infantry guys. They, we have lots of people coming in from all over the place. It's great seeing people progress and get healthier and seeing that color and life come back in their face and getting back into the things they, they used to love to do that their, their injuries were keeping them from doing. And, you know, to conclude, we're going to continue going at it here. We're open nine to nine, uh, seven days a week, floats pretty much every on the hour. We have four float tanks. Also have a yoga studio, uh, physical therapist and massage therapist. My name's Jason Buck. I'm the owner and founder of Rest Float Solutions here in Colorado Springs. We are downtown, new small business, veteran-owned, just here to help people and into health and wellness. And you want to get healthy and get back to who you were before, you know, whatever injury happened to you. We're here to help. It's worked for me in the past. And it's, you know, it's always an ongoing process. Uh, so come down and see us and we appreciate it.